Next one is a mitochondrial inheritance. So this is also non-Mendelian inheritance. In this mitochondrial inheritance, we will discuss the male sterility in pearl maize. So sorghum vulgare is the best example for mitochondrial cytoplasmic inheritance. So it is called as a cytoplasmic male sterility. So in this male sterility is inherited maternally. So in this sorghum vulgari there are two types of the cytoplasm is there. So one is a normal cytoplasm which represents the male is a fertile and another one is a sterile cytoplasm that is apparent cytoplasm which represents male is a sterile one. So in the both two different types of the cytoplasm which is crossed with each other in bow and reciprocal crosses also done in this same plant sorghum vulgare so both the cross normal cytoplasm as uh, sterile cytoplasm in the reciprocal sterile cytoplasm and normal cytoplasm in the both the crosses the f1 generation which is not each other okay which is differ from one other so that is the uh, like the Mirapolis Jalaba, this is also possess the F1 generation is differ each other in the sorghum vulgare. So here the flow chart of the mitochondrial inheritance. So plant with normal cytoplasm is taken as a male is crossed with plant with apparent cytoplasm is taken as a female. Yes. So here F1 male is a sterile plant. So F1 male is a sterile plant. In the reciprocal cross, so plant with apparent cytoplasm. So cannot be male since bolen or sterile. So yes, sterile cytoplasm is crossed with a female. So plant with normal cytoplasm. So can be a female is a normal. So here the cross is not possible. Why means the pollen is sterile. So, the fertilization is not done in the sorghum vulgare. Okay. So, both the F1 generation is not each other. So, both are differ in the F1 generation. Okay. So, like a Mirapolis Jalaba. So, this sorghum vulgare also possesses the cytoplasmic male sterility. Recently, this type of cytoplasmic genetic male sterility is common in many plant species also so this sterility is maintained by the influence of both nuclear and cytoplasmic genes so the common two egg cytoplasm so one is a normal another one is a sterile so both the uh, cytoplasm which is found in a mitochondrion of the plant species that is a sorghum vulgare which is also responsible for the restores of the fertility of genes that is a rf genes the, these restores of fertility uh, this is responsible for the sterile uh, characteristics of the cell characters this rf genes do not any expression of their own so they need or they require the restore uh, fertility genes they require the yes cytoplasm that is a sterility cytoplasm so here the combination of the n cytoplasm and s cytoplasm so the combination of the n cytoplasm with rf rf uh, that means recessive form of the restores of the fertility gene is taken as a male at the same time sterile cytoplasm so capital rf this is the restore of the sterility but uh, which is in a dominant so we already we know it records the sterile cytoplasm okay so both the characteristics are combination and uh, crossed with each other so here the fertile male due to the restore gene so why that the same time the normal rf rf gene that the fertile male is crossed with sterile rf rf genes but here the sterility is uh, represents the homozygous of the recessive gene means the male characteristic is a uh, sterile so uh, it is the the sterility is um, responsible for the both 
न्यूक्लियर एंड साइटोप्लास्मिक जीन्स आई ऑलरेडी टोल्ड इलिया सो मेल साइटो मेल साइटोप्लास्मिक मेल्स जेरिलिटी इज रिस्पॉन्सिबल फॉर बोथ न्यूक्लियर एंड साइटोप्लास्मिक जीन्स आई टोल्ड सो दिस वन इज अ न्यूक्लियर and this one is a cytoplasmic so both the characteristics which is present in the mitochondrial inheritance okay this is the best example of the cytoplasmic genetic male sterility that is a mitochondrial inheritance which is present in the sorghum vulgare